the enactment of this law might be the best way. <clears throat> Sorry. The enactment of this law might be the best way to avoid default and meet the requirements of 100% of Argentina's bondholders. This is not a law to avoid any judgment, it is not a law to evade Argentina's obligations, but it is a law that seeks to fulfil its obligations. I think that's good. Thank you. Cool. That's cool. Okay. No, but this is already a, the same. All right, all right, hold on. In principle, we are rejecting this project due to a technical issue, which is the necessary. <clears throat> in principle, we are rejecting this project due to the technical issue, which is the unnecessary, which is the unnecessary need that the executive has today, because it has delegated powers to handle the issue of debt. Okay. Uh, the only country in Latin America where emergency contraceptive procedures are forbidden is in Honduras. There have been efforts in other countries promoted by the same fundamental forces that operate in the region. But the only country in which they have prohibited this is in Honduras, and they achieved this after the coup d'etat. It has to do with the control over our bodies. Others decide for us. The church, historically, politicians, and doctors have always decided what we should be deciding. The heart of the matter is precisely to maintain the control over women's bodies, over our right to decide freely, autonomously, and without any restriction or intimidation. Let me do it again. No. Uh -huh. That's it. Yeah, <laughs> That the Libre Party has a responsible attitude and opens a real debate in the National Congress is an important advance that is going to bring the importance that this matter deserves. There you go. Oh, let's go, Robert. Okay. There can be no payment change for the bondholders who entered the previous swap because 40% of those holders accepted U.S. jurisdiction for payment, and this cannot be changed, so we will be in default and in contempt with the vulture funds. <laughs> 